There's something you don't see every day. When all you gotta keep is strong, move along, Save move them. along like I know you do. And even when your hope is gone, move along, move along, just to make it through. Are you troubled by strange noises in the night? You experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic. Have you or your family actually seen a spook, specter, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Just pick up the phone and call the professionals. Call the... Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters. We're, We're ready, ready to, to believe, believe you. you. Franchises available soon. Call for details. Whoa! Russell! Hey, man! Do you hear the East Wing? Yep. But by the new ghost or exhibit? Yeah, why? There's something headed your way. Wait. I hear something. I'm gonna take a look. Wanna hear something really creepy? I was reading about Shandor, you know, the guy who donated most of the Gozer stuff. He was into the occult. You know, supernatural. Weird too. <laughs> uh, well, why don't we talk about it some other time? Any other time. <laughs> You can't be in here. Stop! Ghostbusters, is your haunting an apparition, poltergeist, phantasm wraith, banshee demon specter, tortured solar? What? No, we do not summon dead family members and catch them so you can ask the combination to the safe. Yeah, well, same to you, pal. Hey, it's the new cadet! Welcome aboard! This might be a little dangerous. Great. Danger is our life. We'll start at 50% capacity. That should keep any burning or tissue damage to a minimum. Hey, if you're gonna burn any tissue, do it to the new kid. You can't use Ray. Our mortgage is in his name. I guess he's right. What's your name again, kid? No names, Ray. I don't want to get too attached to this kid. You know, just in case... <laughs> you remember what happened to the last guy. He's tuned and ready to go. You may feel a little tingle. Good. We've perfected an extensive and rigorous training regimen that will teach you all your equipment's basic functions. It takes some time to achieve master throw skill, but it's definitely worth the effort. <laughs> Was that us? I don't think so. Ray? Had to be some sort of psi energy pulse. Substantial, a significant collected and centralized necromantic convulsion level seven or more. Agreed, we need EMF measurement checks now. I know the answer, but I'm gonna ask anyway, is a level seven uh, whatever bad or very bad? On a scale of one to 10, I would say, let me guess, it's a seven. Let's just say we're about to get real busy. And that is not the fun kind of getting busy, is it, Ray? Look out! Slimer's escaped again! No, wait, come back.
There it is. It seems oddly drawn to the containment grid. He's been fascinated with it ever since you added the viewer to the unit. Okay, easy now, cadet. I'll talk you through this. Use the proton stream to get his attention. No, not the containment unit. That's some highly sensitive equipment you're disintegrating there, kid. Yeah. Oops, you let one out. That's my fault. I was fine-tuning the interspatial gasket this afternoon. I'll fix it. You two get those ghosts back. He went into the sub-basement, and his escaping friend went with him. Come on, kid. We've got a job for you. Taking the right precautions, Slimer's harmless. Uh, more or less. I'm not sure about the other guy. Okay. Let's go get him. Oh, and uh, don't sweat the containment unit. It's easy to get excited your first time out with a proton stream. Egon will fix it in no time. Now, first and foremost, before things get out of hand, you want to get to know your proton pack. It can be your best friend out there in the field. Everything you need to know is displayed on the pack itself. Here's where you keep an eye on your current physical condition. The more green that's on the bar, the more damage you can sustain and still stay on your feet. This bar indicates your pack's heat level. When it gets to the top, you'll want to vent the pack and keep it from shorting out and resetting. For the most part, capturing a ghost is pretty straightforward. We break it into three basic steps. Sap them, cap them, and trap them. The first step is blasting a ghost to sap its energy. <laughs> You're a wicked shot, Noobie! See that overlay on the ghost? It indicates the current accumulation of a ghost's PKE. The more you disperse, the weaker it becomes. The pack's moving into the red, Cadet Bennett! Slimer. There it is! Ugh, and I thought Slimer was disgusting. All right, you've got it good and winded. Next stage, capture. You can project the capture stream or wrangler manually using this control. On the other hand, the pack will detect when a ghost is sufficiently weakened and auto-select the capture stream setting. Get in there and throw a capture stream on that tub of goo. Fantastic, you've got it! As soon as your ghost is in your capture stream, the slam meter begins to slowly charge. If you want to accelerate the slam meter charge, you can wrangle or counter-wrangle the ghost at the end of the line. Here's how you do that. Watch the ghost. He makes a dash in one. Just by charging up the slam meter, but faster. And there! Oh, yes! One escapee accounted for. Oh, and always remember to retrieve your trap. Did you get them? Ah, uh, we're batting 500. Slimer slipped out. Our cadet bagged his first one, though. Very nasty customer. Oh, and you've got to be very careful about crossing the streams. In a word, don't do it. Seriously. Things like the Dickens, too. Hey, how come this mump gets all the new stuff? He's our new experimental equipment technician. He gets a cool title, too? It means he gets to carry around a bunch of untested, extremely dangerous hardware that, if not handled correctly, could blow him somewhere into New Jersey. Oh, this knucklehead lugs around our very dangerous prototype hardware that could potentially blow us into New Jersey. Thanks. Keep the title, kid. It'll work hard for you. Scooter. We need to go. Let's roll. <laughs> 